Hello Forever family. My name's Shannon. I'm the recovery pastor. I got a question for you. Do you have a game plan? Do you have a game plan for life? Do you have a game plan for the day? Is your goal at the end of your game plan to conquer the day? Or do you feel more consumed by the day? You know, I think we all have a game plan to conquer our day. Or at least that's the intention. But if we break down the day... It looks like several different routines combined together. So the very first one, we start with our hygiene routine. We start out by preparing to encounter others. Each impression we leave is just as important as the first one. So we want the the first routine, our hygiene routine, to be on point. We want to conquer that. Next, we have our daily routine. And this takes us from our home to our workplace, to our career. Then we have a routine that takes us through each task of the day to complete it. Then last, we have a daily routine that takes us from our workplace back home again. So each day, we follow our game plan to conquer our day. This is our personal game plan. This brings fulfillment to what we think is important. But eventually, does life consume us or do we keep conquering our day? What if we had similar game plans in our spiritual day? The first thing we would do is is we would start out our day by preparing to encounter God each and every single day. Each encounter is just as important as the previous. Next, we would follow God's game plan to take us from our current location to our purpose location. We would follow God's game plan to achieve our daily purpose. And last, we would rely on God to take us to our next purpose place with our family. Each day, we would would follow God's game plan. To fulfill our purpose in each day. This is God's plan to fulfill our purpose. Each day is fulfilled and conquered. What if? How would it be different if we had our daily routine, which we do so many times without even thinking that we're doing it? How would it be different if our spiritual routines of obeying God, being in His presence, encountering Him every single day, and allowing Him to take us from purpose place to purpose place? How would our day be? How would our lives be? How would our families view us? What if... Our daily routine was not something that was automatic that we had to think about. And what if our spiritual life was automatic and we didn't even have to think about it? But yet, so many times it's the opposite. We don't think about our daily routines because it's automatic. But we have to think about our spiritual routines. Because they're not automatic. Whose game plan are you following? We can either conquer life or we can be consumed by life. So until next time, check out which game plan you're following. Are you following the world or are you following God's routine? That game plan makes a difference. Speak life. Be a blessing. Put your faith feet into action to cause a ripple effect. Until next time, much agape, everybody.